Hello, hello, hello. I thought I would do a full tutorial on this makeup look. Starting off with skin prep, I'm going in with the Rodeal Dragon's Blood Cleansing Water and the Wellida Skin Food. And then giving the skin a nice spritz of the Cordially Beauty Elixir. Making sure the lips are nice and hydrated with a little bit of Carmex. I'm firstly taking the Blink Brow Bar London Clear Brow Gloss and just brushing that through. And then going in with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow Pomade in Dark Brown. I'm using this to define the brows a little bit more, but Daisy has amazing natural brows anyway. Lightly carving them out with a NARS Creamy Radiant Concealer and then using a MAC Paint Pot in Laying Low as an eyeshadow base. Going in with the Too Faced Natural Nude Palette and just starting to build up a little bit of colour for a light smoky eye and then taking the Pat McGrath Palette and using this Unreal Sparkly Shade on the lid that adds like a really nice translucent glitter. Then using the Inglot Gel Liner to build up a really strong wing and adding that into the bottom waterline and using this to tight line as well. Going in with my favourite mascara ever, which is the Benefit Bad Girl Bang, and then Tatty Lashes TL3. For the skin, I'm starting off with the NARS Light Reflecting Foundation and just applying this all over. And then going back in with the Creamy Radiant Concealer and just concealing in the areas that need a little bit more coverage. Also going in with a liquid blush from NARS in the shade orgasm very well loved charlotte tilbury airbrush flawless finish powder bronzer is the vive muse bronzer duo in medium and then blush is the hourglass blush quad lips are also vive which is bark liner and vive lipstick and yeah here is the finished result sorry about the super rushed voiceover the videos were going way too quick for me to keep up with the talking but yeah i absolutely love this look it is just so classic so glam and perfect for any occasion let me know what you think of this look in the comments